हजर कह बोलने भाई डॉक्टर चाहिए कस बुआ लगे मुआ ल Hello Usually my day starts with a telephone call like usually I wake up at around 6 6:30 and um, I have around 1 hour for myself then around 7 7 7:30 we start getting call and for now I'm going to see a lady who's uh, who has a problem in a food pipe and uh, can't swallow a solid food so see has been um, unable to move out from a bed actually fell off from a bed at the night and then morning was um, uh, uh, figured out by uh, a person uh, a fellow colleague of her and uh, she she was unable to move in a floor so they called me up and in the morning i went and saw them and then i saw it was it was okay they were trying to give her a food they, she was trying trying to eat a food but there was a disbalance in certain care management like nutrition was mismanaged she was um, her condition is there she has a tumor in the oesophagus so it's kind of a situation where she needed a little bit of more customized care management so she uh she happened to be uh, uh taking our service for a week where we actually managed her uh, diet and uh, gave a diet chart and everything else and uh, she took a nursing care as well who actually gave her support at night so that she won't fall off again and now she is better and actually she gave me a call in the morning saying you know hey doctor i'm fine i don't need uh, anything uh, from you know extra hands to support she is mobile and she is confident on that so i'm actually going to see her and see if she is really fine and we'll take off a service easily and then we will be always in a role and wait if she needs anything we will be there available with our services <laughs> I whenever I need you, you should always call on me. Thank you. That's that's nice. And I pray that the service continues, not just help to whom, but he'll but help with love and care. Sure. So it's it's up to the mark that you expected. Yes, I have. I can't expect anything better. Though. Brilliant. So you show me how you walk now. Oh, I can. <laughs> can we walk together? <laughs> sure, I can. Okay, brilliant. So there is no tremble, nothing to worry. The process. What happens is, we go to the people's house, see the issue, try to adjust what is going to be workable for the best for the patient. and also work out with the family what they can afford in their uh, uh capacity so so in our services it's some of the part is uh, people can use it as a luxury and at the same time people can people should use it as a mandatory process so uh it's it's up to people's choice how they use it but at times we have to intervene and say this is going to help you so that is usually done by our care coordinator which includes doctor I used to do it myself but we do have a few more doctors in our team now because the workload has distributed. So we quantify we we uh, design the process of care and uh, we present it to the client who ever need it. So it's basically a very customized process. Not every time it's possible in 100% to do in such way but uh, most of the time we try to give it in a care value then of a individual uh service modality like nursing placements or physiotherapy visit we want to see what result it has achieved and that's the main goal of health at home health at home wants to be a care management and facilitation process cardiology these are the few specific areas where we need to focus for older people primary i think cause is his neurological trauma right head trauma so there's a you know particular way that you deal with it and, and the nurses have been quite good but what i'm saying is maybe this person in the middle could suggest Like 
plan to get it for one week and then flip to the other one. Okay. So the, the problem is, does it go down to the leg or not? No, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. I don't know. See, you, you seem to be staying abroad, like this yeah. is very... You say New York, yeah, you yeah. know, uh, you have seen Nepalese people as an expat, mm -hmm. and uh, you uh, you have seen. Uh, do you think we are doable thing for uh, to connect those need basis for the people who are who have parents here or? Oh, absolutely. I I would imagine that's a natural trajectory for your organization to go towards. It makes should so much sense. Should we do that or not? I think you should. I think you should. I mean, I have an uncle who needs home care, so when, when the time comes, you know, you're the first person that I'm going to reach out to because he's cared for by my father who lives in New York. So I actually don't have the time to go and coordinate, go and coordinate all of that. So right. I could just tell my dad, hey, get in touch with my friend, yeah. uh, Dr. Vishal. So Oh. 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 So to change the We are very result oriented and we would like to make the system more uh, structured in such a way so that we bring more results. Uh, results are good, bad, but the thing is like what we definitely do is bring in more dignified value of service in people's life. <laughs> ए हामी जस्तो बिरामीहरुलाई चाहिँ नि यस्तो सर्भिस धेरै राम्रो हो अब अक्सिजन लाएर अस्पताल जान सकिदैन पुग्न सकिदैन कुर्सीमा राखेर बोकेर ल गाडीमा हैन यस्तो सर्भिसले गर्दा खेरि बिरामीहरुलाई सास फेर्न सजिलो हुन्छ यतिको निम्ति दौडिनु पर्दैन